does. That's a good question. Um, and appetite can be different for anybody with MS. And there's several reasons <clears throat> why. Because MS affects everybody so differently. Um, when it hit me, I actually had a hard time eating. And I got ridiculously skinny and emaciated. I actually couldn't eat for months. I kept, um, one, I had no appetite, but then I just kept, um, I went into spasms. Uh, you know, just like dry heaving all the time. And not everybody is hit that way. A lot of people are hit differently where they'll start to gain weight because of their MS or they might eat differently because they're depressed over their MS or they can't be as active because of their MS. And so sometimes it's hard to rein in those ca that calorie intake if you can't exert it like you want to. Um, so a lot of factors play in, in, uh, cal um, in a weight and eating with MS. I definitely think there are some foods um, uh, that, that we can watch. And those are things like alcohol. Um, I know it's fun. It's the holidays, but that can be hard on you. So just watch that during the, the holidays. Gluten can be pretty draining on a lot of people with MS. And I'm not saying pull it all out and you don't have to be gluten free and all that. But if, if you find that you're eating a lot of bread or just heavy products like that or heavy processed foods, both of those, I would watch the consumption of both of those and keep the food as um, whole and clean as, as you can.